It is also naturally repugnant to most Americans, meaning Americans by choice, whether or not they were born here. Americans by choice, whether or not they were born here, repugnant. Yeah. Uh, Americans in polite society don't like people who are public about their hatred of any particular other people, whether it's Jews or Christians or white people or black people. Right? It's not considered cool in any first world nation. It has nothing to do with America. That's not considered cool in France or in Japan or in England. The American instinct to recoil from anti-Semitism as a particularly toxic form of lun lunacy is a deeply rooted one. So hard yeah. to view yeah, people Hitler as the like bad Hitler guy. Hitler as a bad guy. Yeah, yeah, like he liked cats he painted. He, you know, had real... Right, back to David Samuel's writing in Tablet Magazine. Contrary to what Carlson and his fellows might wish, there is no easy way to decouple the story of the Jewish people, which stretches from the Bible to the establishment of the present-day state of Israel, from either Christianity or the covenantal doctrine on which America was founded. There's no easy way, and yet 99% of Americans, in all practicality, are quite happy to do so. Right? Most, most Americans are not uh, terribly tied up with this theology. Right? Only intellectuals, only those who largely live in an abstract world, get all excited about these things.